The Earth's system. There is atmosphere, biosphere, geosphere, and hydrosphere. There's so many spheres, that's why we're here. First of all, what is a system? A system is a group of parts that interact. What does that mean? Think of a system as a group of gears. Each gear is its own part, but together they work to turn each other. So, what are the parts of the Earth's system? What are they called? Where can they The be first found? part is called the atmosphere. The atmosphere is the mixture of gases that make up the air that surrounds the Earth. Then there's the biosphere. The biosphere consists of all living things on Earth. The geosphere is the solid part of the Earth, from its rocky surfaces to its iron core. Across the mantle, the outer core, and the inner core. Lastly, there's the hydrosphere. The hydrosphere is the water that makes up the Earth's oceans, lakes, rivers, and more. It also includes the polar ice cap and other ice. These are the four parts of the Earth's system. Scientists call them spheres. Then, how is Earth a system? Think back again to the gears. The gears are parts that interact and affect each other. Many occurrences in nature show the Earth's spheres working as a system. Think about it. Volcanic eruptions are an example. So is a storm. The simplest way to see how Earth's system works is to follow the growth of a plant. A seed flows through the wind and nestles itself in the ground. With time and nutrients from the soil along with some water, the seed begins to grow. Through the process of photosynthesis, the plant absorbs carbon dioxide and releases oxygen. Here, we can see the spheres working in unison. Atmosphere, biosphere, G.